What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Jumaya's World. And right now we're going to be talking about Division Dynasty Release 2 and how you can get any of the 96 overall players for free that are going to be dropping very soon in Madden 24 Ultimate Team. It's going to be a very, very simplistic walkthrough because EA Sports has not released any information about how the cards are going to work and what's going to be happening. But pretty much we're going to go through the ways that we normally do it. And um, we're going to formulate our own system, which has been helping a lot of you guys to build your teams very, very easily and not having to spend as much money. Uh, the feedback has been extremely positive about understanding the game itself. I do want to point out we did get our free player, but we were only able to make about 500k. Uh, we did invest in the old line and things like that as far as the Genki Force. So you'll see that I don't have the other star offers like the regular 96 overall. And I bought uh, one of the heroes as well. This is another pro tip. It used to be the champions were three of them for the 96 and 97 overalls to max out their elevations. EA Sports has dropped it so that the first upgrade you can use a 93 overall. And yes, you can use the 93 overall B and D that you get from this as well. All right, to upgrade it. So I'm going to show you guys that as well because I know that some of you guys are going to be asking about the Genki Force. Um, but yes, we did upgrade our players. So any of these guys, right, we added this guy and we added this guy. The first slot that they have now is not a champion and you can use an elevation pass if you want and not. But this right here is a hero, okay, for the first one. And then everything else you would have to, you know, either spend money or use the high elevation passes. I just wanted to touch base on that before we go ahead and get started with everything else. So if you wanted to invest in any of the elevation players, go ahead and do so. It's fine. Everything's going to be good. You should be all set with that. All right. Now we're going to jump over into uh, the set, right? So what we remember from the last part of the Division Dynasty Part 1, some of you guys are new to the game, so you don't really understand what's going on. So my veterans and some of the newbies, you guys are going to learn from this, all right? Pretty much what they did was they released these type of sets where you can make any 88s that was going into the different divisions, right? So it's like, you know, whatever it is, you, you know, Niners, whatever, it, it tells you exactly what, whatever it is. The NFC West, the NFC South, the North, the East, all that stuff. So depending on what type of theme teams you have, they gave you the base setup, right? And then from that base setup, it was very simplistic. You were able to make 91s, all right? So the 91s pretty much took the cards that you made prior to going into that, you know, after you made that set, you would pick one and then put it in there. I do believe they're going to do the same format, but this is what's going to happen. They are going to up the overalls. Obviously, the 91s are not prevalent and they wouldn't dare drop anything. The, the lowest overall I believe that they're gonna drop, in case you guys are asking, is a 95, which will also be stupid, but I would say 95 to 96. And that's ultimately the best way for them to do it with where the cards are right now. If you guys are asking specifically like why, because the video has not come out from EA Sports or they haven't released any of the overalls. But this is like me just looking to what they're doing. It's probably going to be a lot more duplicates of cards that you already have. Or maybe they'll probably give you guys cards that, you know, we've been waiting for. Either way, it doesn't matter. It's going to be 95, 96. Whichever way they put it out, this is going to be the format. Okay, so I just want to I want to go ahead and point this out to you guys. The 88s will not be relevant unless, for whatever reason, they make it like the last part of it. Like you see, like with this 88 set, it tells you you have 186 to 87, then 80, you know, then any 3 80, uh, 84 to 85s, and then any 82 to 83s. They could split it up like that, where at the end you need some 88s, but more than likely they're gonna need 91s and above. So you may need these to complete the set. And I want you guys, when it's released, to come back and let me know how spot on I am. I'm usually right there with what they're looking for, but it would make sense that they would use these 91s to create the 96s. The similar way that you use the other overalls, you know, specifically for what they're doing. Because remember, if you look at it specific to the AKAs, that's what this is like. So, the, you know, any AFC West team, stuff like that, it's specific to the program. It's not like the Super Bowl where you could put any of anything in it. So let me show you what I'm talking about. So, and then we're going to go over the cards that you're going to probably need, right? When you go to AKA Cruise, you can't just go ahead and put any 93 in this. It's going to be any 93 from the AKA Cruise and then the specific one that goes in for the fifth card. Super Bowl and like most feared and stuff like that, you can do any. Let me give you an example of what I'm talking about. If you go over to like the Super Bowl pass, right? It's any of the players. You can see we can actually redeem them right now. We already have all of the cards that are available because it's any, right? So regardless of what they put out there, we can still make the coins from other sets to go ahead and complete that one. 
And that's what I've been showing you guys a lot of, and many of you guys have been starting to catch on, and you've been making a lot of coins, and it, th that's what I want for you guys. I don't want when, when a promo drops, you're immediately in the store and you got your credit card in your hand. You should be able to utilize a lot of the items that you already have. It makes the game a lot easier. Trust me. Whenever I need more coins, I just go to see what I got, and I just start making cards. You know, it is what it is. I just start making cards and figuring it out from there. All right, so now that we understand that, as far as like the specific part of the program, we're gonna go back to the Division Dynasty. So this was the last part of the actual program. So EA Sports has two options, right? They can either make us use these 91s to create another card that goes into the champion set, or they can just let us use these 91s in the set. Regardless of which way they do it, you're going to probably need some of these lesser items. And I want you guys to understand, do not start completing these sets. All right, make sure you guys understand it, especially my no money spent players. If you're no money spent, NMS in the comments, because you guys are wild. You guys stop building cards. Do not build anything. Just know that you have what's available to be put into the set and then wait. And there's another example, right? Just so you guys understand what's happening. Remember when they did the Campus Heroes Part 2? This is what they did, right? They didn't really give us any other, um, where is it, Campus Heroes 2? They didn't really give us a lot of other ways to make stuff. This is what they did. They just upped this to a 91. That's what they did. This is ultimately what happened and where everybody was. They're like, yo, gee, what, why are they doing this right now? Why are they making it any 91? It could be random like this. It could be. That's why I don't want you guys to utilize the other, you know, the other sets and everything like that. This is something that people need to really understand that EA Sports switches it up on us. So if they do it like this, because it's a part two of a previous program, it could work out in all of our benefit because we will have the cards already to go ahead and use the core set, the most feared set, whichever set it is to get the specific cards that we need. Also, remember, if you're worried about 93s, you can use 93s for the Genki or you can make them from the NFL Honors Pack. So the reason I want you guys to keep all your lower level elites ready to go, because that's the only way you're gonna get it for free at launch. Now, remember, there are gonna be a situation, there, are, there will be situations where EA Sports is gonna probably drop a limited that you guys want. And you could be like, yo, gee, can I get a limited for free? No, because you have to now, you, listen, you're gonna have to make the champions and probably make two to get one limited. So can you get it for free? Yes, but it's gonna be very strenuous because like usually I do this one time and I sell the card at launch and I make my coins there. That's why you see me ready with the Super Bowl pass to redeem that and sell that card for about 400K and be ready to go for whatever they drop. I don't just sell the 92s, I hold on to them and I wait to see what comes next. After that happens, it doesn't matter which way they release it with the cards, I'm prepared. That's all I try to do for you guys here. Make sure you're prepared for it. So, looking at it this way, guys, remember that I'm telling you this. It could be very, very simplistic, okay? Where they make it so that all you need to do with the five is just like, look, you know what, guys? Any of whatever. But if I, my gut feeling is they're going to keep it the same way. And they're going to make it, you know, promo specific. So we will have to have cards that are lower level to make the cards in that specific promo. So don't redeem any of these yet. I have them ready to go. You can see all of them say to redeem, but I'm waiting to see what they're gonna do. Once it drops, we all go crazy and we get the, you know, we get the coins, we make the cards and we're out there, dude. And that's it. That's how we're gonna do it. That's how you're gonna get any of these uh, Division Dynasty Part 2 players for free. Hopefully you enjoyed the content. If you did, become a member of the channel. Visit me on a live stream. Hit me up on X at Gmyers World, Instagram, Facebook, all that stuff. I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. You have an unbelievable day. Until next time, one love, y'all.